don't need recognition. I'm on a mission. I'm paying dues. I'm in position. I'm staying up. It's getting late. You're doing good. I'm doing great. Recognition. I'm on a mission. I'm paying dues. I'm in position. I'm eating tacos again. Literally the same shit I ate yesterday because it's just so fucking good. God, that's enough. That's all the content you get for right now because I'm gonna fucking die then. Just kidding, I guess I can talk. We're gonna try and find somebody to go drink with out on the town because I need to go do something and not be in this house anymore. I'm just kidding, it's amazing. I love this house, I could be here forever. But I need to go do something and not just chill here anymore. So, and also the big town party starts today. They have like rides and stuff out there. So I'm gonna try and find someone to go with. One of my cousins, Karen, said that she would go with me, but I don't know what time, so we'll see. up i just finished getting ready to go out into the town with my cousin karen and we're gonna see what kind of trouble we can get ourselves into that is the fit yesterday i didn't really do that much i went with my mom out into the town and i got some pretty much drinks actually i got a little tipsy but that was fun and then we walked back to my abuelitas and i edited a youtube video I'm not really that close with my family here specifically the kids my age so I'm gonna really try and have fun with Karen because she's definitely one of the closest to. <laughs>
fun. Got a tattoo yesterday. Now, I'm not a big fan of Hot Cheetos at all in the U.S. I'm not a big... I don't really like them. I'm more of a hot fries kind of person. But the fucking Hot Cheetos here in Mexico are like dynamite. First of all, look at them. They're like, totally different. Like, so amazing. Crisp, so red, so flaming, so hot. That's hot. It's amazing. I can't get enough. Truly, honestly, it's amazing. So much better than the U.S. Mmm. Let's do one more little. Listen to the crunch. Mmm. 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 Today is the last day of this whole party thing that they do here. But it's beautiful outside and I can't complain even if I've been here all day not doing anything. I don't know if I ever showed the view from my grandma's house, so I'm gonna show you that. It's really pretty. So I just realized, um, this whole time, every single day that I've been working out, people can see through this window and they can, like, see in. And this is the way that it was before. Like, it has this second layer or whatever, but it's tied. And I just realized I can untie that so that nobody can see me. Because the last couple of times that I've been working out, people have just been walking by and have obviously been able to see, like, full on just me working out. And I'm not naked or anything, but still. And now I just realized I can just do that and now people don't see me. I'm not insecure or anything, but like, that would have been cool to know a couple days ago, or well, a week and a half ago. Well, Molly was no average girl, tearing me a tight, tight, telling all the whole damn world.
going to Tepusco, baby. I say that like it's a beach. <laughs> I say that like it's a resort. It's not. <laughs> Truth. It's time for me to get something off of my chest. Seriously, super important. Nothing but the fact. I just can't keep hiding this from you guys. I have not worked out in four days. <gasps> That's right. That's right. What am I going to do about that? Absolutely nothing. I'm just kidding. I'm going to work out. <laughs> Um, I used to be really toxic with my working out habits, and I used to force myself to do it, like, every single day, obviously, but um, for a long time throughout the day. If I didn't work out a certain day, I would feel shitty about myself. If I ate something that maybe wasn't the best, I would feel so shitty about myself, and my self-esteem would just be completely ruined because my mental health was not stable at the time. However, now... I'm okay taking four days of not working out and not bullying myself for it. So yeah, today we're gonna go hard and do the best I can and not judge myself for the way my body does and know that the last four days and just taking a break sometimes is completely normal and following what your body is telling you is normal and I should not be judging myself for it. If there's a difference between discipline and toxicity and for me it was really hard to find the balance between those because I would just come up with so many negative thoughts in my head if I did not work out that day so you know if you don't work out one day it's totally fine it's totally normal you don't have to being disciplined does not mean that you have to let it take over all of your thoughts throughout your day and yeah just give it your best and if you're doing your best then that is the best that you can do and be happy with it and don't let it affect you. Don't compare where you don't compete. <laughs> just kidding. No, literally, yeah, just don't compare yourself to other people and the way they take on their fitness journey. Your body cannot physically change in just one day. If I don't work out one day, that's not gonna ruin the whole months and months of work that I've done. That's not gonna, yes, maybe it might offset my body a little bit, but as long as I'm okay with it and it's something that I mentally am okay with then it shouldn't affect me at all sometimes you need to take a little break so that you can come back even harder you get what I'm saying so yeah now that I my body is craving this we're gonna go so yeah just don't be toxic with your fitness journey just don't be toxic with the way you exercise and the way you work out and let it affect your eating habits either these last couple of days I have been eating the way I want and just enjoying myself and enjoying the fact that I'm here in Mexico and I have opportunities to eat food that I'm not going to have when I go back to the United States. So I'm not going to make myself feel guilty for enjoying those foods. Friendly reminder to you, Fabian, just continue to not be toxic and do your best. This is me doing my best, so continue to do your best. Yeah.